Welcome to Ms. Baker's Magic Music Lab. Today we're going to do the magic bell sound experiment. You will need scissors, string, and a teaspoon from your kitchen. So ask for permission, please. Before we do our experiment, we're going to talk about sound because that's what our experiment is about. So sound travels in waves. This is a picture of sound waves. So when we make a sound, it just goes out into the air. Well, we're going to do an experiment and our sound is going to travel a little bit different way. So first we need to take our string and we need to cut a length one meter or around four feet long, whichever way you want to measure. And that's about a meter. There's where we need the scissors. And then we're going to take our string and we're going to make a loop in it. So just like when you're tying your shoestrings, you make a loop and then pull the string through. So now I have a loop kind of in the middle. And then I'm going to tighten it around the handle of the spoon. Tight so that the spoon doesn't drop. And then I'm going to hold the string up to my ear and swing the the spoon into the counter, the side of the counter, to strike the side of the counter. You don't have to do it very hard. And listen to what happens when you do that. So watch what it, I'm gonna swing it. When I do that, the sound waves love to travel up things, so they travel up the string, string into my ear and the spoon sounds like a bell. So I urge you to try this at home. So I'll do it one more time. So I'm just gonna swing it. And I can hear a bell sound. Now, if I take a bigger spoon, I can make even a bigger bell sound. I'm gonna do it with a big spoon. One, two, three. Ooh, that one's a lower pitch. Ow. So when I swung the spoon into the counter, you probably heard this. But this is what I heard. And that's what you'll hear if you hold a string up to your ear while you swing the spoon. When I did the bigger spoon, the pitch was lower. So it was a lower sound. So give it a try at home. I hope you had fun in Ms. Baker's Magic Music Lab today.